<laughs> Look at some old creep is gonna be like, mmm. <laughs> is that blurry? Yes. Oh, it was literally just on manual focus. Hi guys. Yes. What's up, guys? What's up? <laughs> Today, Bailey and I are getting our little ears pierced. Hopefully, yeah. I can film it because I want to like, I want to have this video so I can like prove to people that I didn't cry. She's so excited. You, you have a high pain tolerance. Yeah. Also, this is the first time that we're seeing each other in Her months. Mind. I genuinely have a headache. I haven't had coffee yet today. Drink it. I, I'm oh, gonna right. die. Okay, so I go through the drive-thru <laughs> and I'm like, hi, can I please have like an almond milk latte? And the guy's like, sure. And then she goes, what teas do you have? He lists every single tea. And then they gave me an oat milk latte, which is not gluten-free, so I have to go back and get a new one. Okay. We don't look related at all now. I was just saying, like, we don't look the same at all. I look so blonde next to you. I feel like the I feel like I feel like the viewers like missed you. Aww, I missed you guys. Oh, <laughs> I always read all the I'm comments. Like, I'm like looking to see if there's any hate on me. <laughs> <laughs> looking to see if anyone's like, oh my god, girl, really sucks. No, there isn't yet. I haven't seen any yet. The plan for today. Do you want to explain the plan for today? Um, have one. Little taekwondo suits. Aww. Oh my god. We don't really have a plan. Go to Starbucks and then our appointments are at 11.45 and 12. And then it's to hang out at the mall. <laughs> All day. All day. Wait, I want to film like me like getting a new drink. Like okay. telling her that I literally <laughs> am allergic like, to almond um, milk. Just be like, sorry, but. I have celiac disease this... and this is going to kill me. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Hi, thank you for sure. Sorry, Hi, um, I was just here and I ordered an almond milk latte, but I got an oat milk latte. Okay, no worries. So what size would you like for that one? A grande, please. A grande almond milk latte? Yes. Uh, when do you can't come by? Uh, it was like five minutes ago. Like, probably okay. less. I, I got you to list all the teas. <laughs> yeah, the person who made the drink just told me that they ensured it was made with almond milk. The sticker was just wrong. Oh. Yeah. Are you sure? Because I'm like allergic to oat milk. Uh, she says 100%. Okay. okay. Okay, well, thank you. If you die, you sue. We got yeah. it on tape. 100%. Starbucks? You better be scared. <laughs> no, I think I can actually taste it. Tell. I can tell. Okay, tell. Okay. okay. It's almond milk. Ah. Uh, that all could have been avoided. Okay, now just drop so pounds. Yeah, go. Hurry Please. Up. Wave. <laughs> Why did you do that? Okay, okay now we're gonna jam out. Yeah, we're gonna jam out. <laughs> Cut this out because no copyright. Okay, bye. I like, no, I like the bigger one. The big one? Wait, let me see your ear. I like that the one. The bigger one? Like the one that one, one and the one below. But I also kind of like these ones down here. That's a good <laughs> one. You're gonna get demonetized. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. <laughs> I'm scared. No, we're fine. We're adults. No, this is literally whatever. It's like 10 minutes to our appointment, but like we want to like pick out our earrings. I think like, we have to tell them. Yeah, are you giving? Okay. Bailey can't get it. Her ears it's are too so small. small. That's so sad. Why are you guys going to be like that? And she said that I had just enough room, so she was scared that it was going to like come off. So I think we're just going to do regular Felix up here. We can also do like the dangly piercing then. Like the one with yeah. the string. And it can connect to your double. Yeah, exactly. Before here. Same. I'm shaking. I didn't eat. Like, we want that, right? Yeah. That one. Yeah, this gives us more options for earrings. Yeah. Are you excited? I'm so shy. I'm shaking. <laughs> Stop. Check that out. Okay. Okay. Let's see. That's like the same length. Or is it too so high? Make sure your head's straight. Like a I think maybe a little, like, like just little under little? it. Yeah. The lower one, yeah. Already good. So when I tell ya, you, you're gonna take a big breath in. Okay, and then I'm gonna okay. count down three, two, one. Once I get to one, you breathe out and I'll book you. Okay. Are we ready? Mm-hmm. Big breath in. And three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> How's that? That was not even that bad. <laughs> Loki could feel it going through every tendon, like not tendon. Blood vessel. Oh my god. Guys, I did it. Is it bleeding? Not, um, not much. Not like what she did. Oh, that's, that's like a so pool of blood. Again. Yeah, I know. I didn't oh. lie to you. You really, you really did it. So we got the oh. piercing. Ow! Oh my god, I just pulled on it. Billy, do you want to say your experience? It was great. <laughs> um, I got blood everywhere. So. But it was. But then she was like, "Do you have low iron?" And then Billy was like, "Yeah." So if you have low iron, you get like a piercing like this. It might bleed. It'll bleed a lot. But it's fine though. Like it wasn't like a bad thing. No. I would say pain would be like six out of ten, and my lobe is like a three out of ten. This one one is a titanium one and it was $60 and it's then the service itself was $40. The girl that we went to, her name was Emma. Her Instagram was Emma Does Piercings. We love her. She's so nice. So nice. Like she made me feel so much more comfortable. Like she was
was talking to me, making jokes. I literally said I was gonna pee on the chair and she was like, yeah, I'm not going yeah, to Meta. Yeah, so we definitely recommend Emma from Steel and Ink. And if you have any questions about it, then just leave them down below. That's it. Yeah, I think we're gonna go back and shop and I kind of want to buy Air Forces, so. <laughs> do you have anything to say? That was fun. <laughs> What's the move? What do we think out of 10? I love this. I love it's it too. Soft. It's velvety. Oh, I really like this. But I already have a black hat though. Okay, pick another one. I kind of like the brown. Yes. The yeah, one. that one. What if I got like a red one? No, let's not do that. <gasps> Shut up. That oh, looks so God. good. It fits so good. We share it. <laughs> We're currently in heaven. I like these ones. These ones right here, they're like platformy. These are huge. Like, look how big these are compared to my hand. These are all men's sizes. What's like a big one? This one. <laughs> what? These look like the ones that I'm wearing right now. The red, the blue. We like the purple. Oh, the, the, these. These are so sick. Oh my God. And the dunks. Oh, and I like these. Uh, okay, guess how much these are? Four. Two eighty. Oh, okay. So a bargain. Good, good. <laughs> we are currently in Indigo. And look. We're in the baking section. Look at that. That looks divine. <gasps> How much is this book? Oh, that looks so good. If you're interested, it's called a good bake. Oh my god, look at this cookie. Oh, I'm hungry now. Oh my gosh. We're literally just waiting for our reservation because we passed our reservation back to 645. We're just literally waiting <laughs> until Serena comes. And we're just really loud. We're just both really loud people. I said my indoor voice is like everyone else's outdoor voice. Now baby, stand up. <laughs> Plans have a little bit changed again. Serena got in a snow drift. She's not going to be here until 8. So Billy and I are just going to go to the reservation and then meet up with her after. We feel like we're crusty right now. Our makeup is like crusting off of our face. We're gonna kind of redo our makeup and change so we look a little bit more Moxie's apparel. <laughs> Moxie's? <laughs> this is all the makeup that I brought. I have the Adeline Morin Tarte eyeshadow palette, no beauty blender, <laughs> concealer, brushes, lip gloss, and eyeliner. I can feel us getting hangry. We're close. <laughs> I can feel like me getting annoyed. I the lighting is so good though. Okay, we need some hype music yeah. so that we can do this. Oh my god, wait, this is actually kind of fun. I feel like liking it now that I have my shoes off. We're still in the Indigo parking lot, by the way. Blasting music, like literally right here. Okay, so we were actually rushing to get ready for dinner because somehow we were Agreed. late, but this is the final look. Um, update on the earrings. We are a little tender. <laughs> it's just a little sore. Like, I definitely won't be able to sleep on it. We were both discussing how we literally just want to, like, shower and, like, get in comfy clothes and stuff. But we still haven't met Serena. Right now, we're going to go meet her somewhere, hang out for a little bit. And then I'm going home. Like, it's not like I'm sleeping over at Bailey's. And also, like, it was, no one like, was there. No one. It was, like, there was, like, three people there. <laughs> and we literally were, like, and then we come back in the car and we're straight screaming for five minutes. And we're, like, what are we talking talking about but like compare this clip to the clip oh, before <laughs> where they're like we're getting ready yeah, <laughs> like, but also my camera died which is why i'm <laughs> vlogging on my phone it's probably really bad quality my hair looks so big right now but hello it is the next day so i want to explain what happened yesterday so basically my camera died and it like literally died when we were getting ready for dinner and then later we met up with serena and we hadn't seen her in so long like i hadn't seen her in months it's a lot of people's reading weeks so a lot of my friends from university are coming back like into my hometown which is still far away from me but I drove back and I really wanted to see Serena that day so when she got out of her literal snow drift I went to go pick her up at her house and it was like 9 p.m. at that point we just drove around I literally love seeing my friends it actually boosts my mood so much and I was just so energized I ended up driving home at like 12 in the morning and I was like fully awake I was like buzzed I was on a high I went to bed so late last night I went to bed at like 2 a.m. and then I woke up today kind of early because I needed to get ready for my photo shoot. I have a photo shoot with Michelle. I've done two photo shoots in the past with her. I love her. She's literally the sweetest person. I would recommend her so much if you're in the area. I will link her Instagram. Yeah, so we wanted to do like a city vibe. So I think we're just gonna go downtown into our city. I have three outfits planned. I, I literally just plant them. I like stuck them behind here. I don't usually use hairspray, but I feel like it, it's gonna fall because I also like to like kind of play with my hair in the photos. So I don't want it to fall. And usually with photo shoots it ends up falling but I also don't want to spray too much because it can weigh down the hair I've been posting on Instagram practically every single day and it's so fun I love posting on Instagram I love everything about it so is that all the updates I had to tell you I think that's all the updates okay 
I'm heading to the photo shoot right now. I have all of my bags packed with all my outfits and stuff. I think I might just get there right on time and we just found a meeting location that we're gonna meet at and I will bring you along. My hair's already getting really staticky, but it's okay. Do you wanna say hi? <laughs> hi guys. Hi. This is my favorite photographer ever, Michelle. Stop. I'm linking your things down below. Okay. So you can... <laughs> Thank you. No, it's okay. I haven't been here in so long. Why is everyone taking photos? We just saw three separate people taking photos. Oh, this is perfect. the first outfit which is this not including the jacket what we basically do is we just like walk around the whole city and find like cute little places to take a photo and we're like yeah that yeah. looks good and then we'll just do it now we're gonna change to a second outfit find a bathroom and change you ever wondered how many photos you take it's like two or three still going Maybe. still going yeah okay that's all i got Oh my gosh, it's a struggle getting masks off with this piercing. What is this lighting? We just ended the photo shoot. It is five o'clock now. Then we walked to Starbucks and we got some coffee and just sat and talked. Once again, best person ever. I can't wait for you guys to see these photos. These are gonna be sick. I think this is the best photo shoot we've ever done. Right now, my sister I think is home. So I'm gonna go and kind of spend like family day with my family, even though it's the day before family day right now. I think we're gonna have like tacos or something. I'm gonna have like lettuce tacos for dinner. I have to post this little thing on my story. We took a little visco disco. I haven't taken a visco disco in so long. Um, we took a couple, but this is one of them. Oh, I'm just such on a high vibe right now. I really hope it's transmitting and the makeup is crusting off of my face. Hey guys, I just wanted to insert this little clip. I just went shopping at the mall for like four hours. I literally could have spent more time there, but I had to cut it off because that's literally insane. And it, I was by myself. I was trying to set up my outfits for my photo shoot and I just like couldn't put together outfits. And I was like, Sadie, you need to buy clothes better. Like you need to actually buy clothes you're actually gonna wear and that you can make outfits out of. I still need to find a couple more basics that I didn't end up finding. And obviously I didn't end up buying all basics because these are not all basics, but I kind of got a little bit sidetracked, but like there weren't even that expensive so I just wanted to show you but also my outfit today I really liked I don't think I took an Instagram in it but I'm probably going to eventually this little top is from Princess Polly and like I sometimes button up but I just like left it unbuttoned this tank top is from Aritzia just a regular black tank and then I have these jeans from American Eagle I will link these down below and I also had my blue and white Nike mids on like blue black and white i also was like posting on my instagram story asking you guys for help on like what to buy so thank you if you responded but let's get into this little haul and i'm gonna try to insert i think i have some clips of me like trying stuff on on my phone because i always take videos of myself in the mirror so i can like look back and see what i look like from different angles and so i can send it to like my mom and my friends for their opinions the first top that i got is actually a basic top it's from garage i was just looking for cropped long sleeves to like layer and to dress up or to dress down it goes like that and i got this in a size small for reference garage is going off lately like i could have bought so many things in that store i had to refrain so i only limited myself to try on a couple things i went to this store called envy and grace they had so many brands inside of that store they had like levi's free people guess which you know that i love i found this mock neck bodysuit which fit perfectly and it's nice and thick and warm for the winter so i can layer and stuff i can't wait to sell this and this was on sale for 30 dollars it was usually $60. This is from the brand Better Be. Then I think I got another black top. I couldn't find any of these tops in white. Like I wasn't just trying to get black, but I also got this regular full-ish length black top from Bozolo and it was on sale for $19.50. Okay, now we're gonna get to the fun things. I was also looking for little dresses for the spring and for summer that I could wear just because I was kind of lacking in that department. I went to Urban Planet. Urban Planet is like my little hidden gem. I swear none of my friends shop there. Like they never shop there. And I literally walked into that store and I could have bought probably 20 things. I loved so many things. I went into the dressing room and I was carrying like 12 items and she's like, you can only try 
down five. I really wanted a basic black dress that fits really well. This is so flattering. So I just got really hard to show what this looks like just holding it up. I'll insert a little triangle clip. This fit really well and it's also adjustable on the sides and it was also not see-through at all. Plus everything was buy one get one free. I got this dress which they had so many different patterns in this. I'll try to insert some photos of the patterns that they had. I got this little number. This is like a plaid v-neck dress. Obviously I'd probably wear something like a little tank underneath. These are dresses that I would wear with sneakers or I could dress them up with heels if I wanted to like maybe some some white heels or some white little sneakers. Then I got this cute little black dress perfect for summer. Dress it up, dress it down. It has adjustable straps. Yeah and this is in a size small. I think I got all of these dresses in a size small. The last dress that I got was in this color. It's actually the same style as the other one but I don't think I have a try on of this one. This is a pattern. Um, these were like kind of my splurge items. Lisa got points for it right? If you guys are shopping at Garage a lot make sure to get their app because I get so many points. I just got this basic racerback tank top. I am gonna wear this literally every day and also this is the same material as the seamless plunges that I have. My friends and I are obsessed with the seamless plunge. Every day last summer if we were going to like go out to dinner or something we'd be like which seamless plunge are we gonna wear today? So I got one in white and I was actually asking you guys if I should get this on my Instagram story and a lot of you said yes a lot of you also said no. I could definitely understand that, but I think I have an idea on how I'm going to style this color. So I got that. And the last thing that I got is this shirt that I just needed to get. Like, I don't know why I tried it on. I was wearing my blue Jordans at the time and it matched perfectly. I took so many photos in the dressing room, which I'm probably gonna post on Instagram. This just fits so well. It's the same seamless material, so stretchy. Basically run to Urban Planet and to Garage right now is what I'm saying, okay. Bye. Hello, it's future me. I'm currently editing this vlog right now, right there. And I know that it was kind of all over the place. It was a really confusing vlog because I had originally filmed from the time where I organized my car up until the photo shoot in that haul. But the vlog ended up being like 40 minutes. So I just decided to split it in two and then upload a bonus video this week. So thumbs up for the bonus video. This was kind of like all over the place in like a lot of different days, but I really hope that you still enjoyed it. And yeah, subscribe and press the bell if you want to stick around. I would love to have you. That's is a heart. I can't do this. All my friends can do it so easily. And we need to like... I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye.